you see as the time goes on the field becomes uh, more and more complicated and then you get an anomaly growing in the northern hemisphere where the magnetic field now is going out. There is a reversal. Now the magnetic field is outward in the northern hemisphere and inward in the southern hemisphere. So now the burning question is, is what's happening in Gary's model reflected in the real Earth? Is the 300-year decline in our field, which the pottery reveals, the work of magnetic anomalies brewing deep in the core beneath our feet? If so, then a reversal really could be in the cards.